Hi everyone, my name is Andrew, I'm creator of the game Druid Test of Faith, and today I would like to show you and tell you how to draw a tree in Photoshop for your 2D game. Right now you can see the 4K resolution environment where I would like to fit my tree, and just to match all sizes let's set player to this environment. Afterward I would like to add a reference image, and as a reference I'd like to recommend you to use a bonsai trees, it looks wonderful. Let's scale it up and remove everything we do not need. And also we need to enlarge trunk size, because right now it looks like a carrot. Next, let's make a silhouette of everything we've got. Move it a little bit aside and make a small palette for our tree drawing. Cut away the crown, we do not need it right now. And try to draw branches for our tree silhouette. And while you're watching how I'm walking, let me tell you a few curious things about drawing itself. In 2D art, deepness and volume do not exist at all. Everything you can draw, basically, flat. And that is the main secret to draw everything you would like to. To draw any object, is it mountains, ground or trees, you need to start from a solid color. Object volume and its weight do not depend on some mysterious skills of drawing. Basically everything what makes your object feels voluminous is shadows. And every object you are trying to draw is only a solid color with the shadow gradations. And of course its form. And as you can see I'm taking my form from a reference. It is a good practice for you. Do not try to invent something new, nature already invented everything for us. The next trick for our mind is to make our tree dirty. You know, when you are trying to draw something new, you always will have a fear of blank space. But if you will make it dirty, add well lines or spots as I did, you can trick your mind and it will help you to finish your artwork. And also I would like to mention another one trick I use in this work. To draw a tree trunk I use only two brushes round with sharp and smooth edges. And the trick you should know about is brush opacity. To add a quick shadow to object you are drawing, you need to select black color and set brush opacity to about 30%. And there is a shortcut on a keyboard for that purpose. That's numbers from 1 to 0, where 1 is 10% opacity and 9 is 90% opacity. But 0 resets it to null. Also, I guess you need to know what you shouldn't try to draw a perfect line. Basically, there is nothing perfect in nature, and you need to draw as your heart tells you to draw.
So right now our trunk is ready and I've shaded a little bit for our tree crown. To make a tree crown I've downloaded with leaves from Google Pictures and made from the brush. You can check brush settings with settings tab at right. So the last thing we need to do is to draw our leaves at three layers. Background, foreground and midground. And afterward clean it a little bit. Well, I've drawn a tree to replace another one tree in my game. So now I will launch my game and show you how it looks. If you wish to, you can download my game on Steam and check it by yourself. Demo is free available for everyone. And also, if you would like to get with tree a PSD file in 4K resolution, you can support me on Patreon. You can find all necessary links in the description section below. So thanks everyone for watching and see you in the next video. And also, I would like to say thanks to my first patron, S. Rose. You are breathtaking, remember it.